Welcome to my workshop. In this video, I will show you how to make these two versions of pencil cases without sewing. I used mushy plush fabric for this. You can take any other fabric as long as it's dense enough. So you'll need a piece of cloth 25 by 30 centimeters and a zipper at least 25 centimeters long or longer and a glue gun. Let's get down to assembly right on. Place your zipper in front of you, pull her up and the fabric inside up. Now let's glue the cloth in this position. Apply the glue close to the edge of the zipper. If you still don't feel like a confident glue gun user, do it step by step. Press the cloth tightly and carefully. Make sure you wait for the glue to dry a bit, at least 40 seconds. Now apply some glue over here. Lift the fabric, place it on the other side of the zipper and press like this. Wait for the glue to work. On the other side it looks like this, very neat and secure. Now I'll show you another way to attach the fabric to the zipper. You can use it if you like. First, I apply the glue like this, along the edge of the cloth. And make a bend of about half a centimeter. Here's a life hack for you. If you're worried that the glue will dry unevenly, heat up the seam with the iron and let it cool. Now let's move on. Press the just treated edge to the zipper. Place the fabric a little bit away from the zipper blade so that it wouldn't get in the way when you'll be opening or closing your pencil case. So, that's the workpiece I've got for now. Now you can choose what kind of a pencil case you'd like to make. Like this, or maybe like that, or even like this. I'm going to make the first version. I open the zipper and turn the piece inside out. To secure the open end of the zipper, I fix it in place with some tape. Now is the time to cut off the part of the zipper we're not gonna need. And fold the pencil case into the required position. The zipper is open and now we're going to glue the sides. Apply the glue like this along the edge, then press and let cool. Do the same on the other side. And that's pretty much it, my dears. The pencil case is ready. I remove the tape, we don't need it anymore. Wait for the whole thing to dry and turn it outside out. Look how cool it came out. Even though we glued it without sewing, the pencil case holds together very nicely. Here you can cut the zipper edges a little, just to make it look neater. That's how you can create your own pencil case almost in no time. Let's just torture it a little bit more. Now I'll show you how to make a 3D bottom. Take an edge and open it like this, and tuck it in with your finger just a little bit. And then glue this seam. Wait for it to dry. And 
Surprise, surprise! Here comes the three D bottom. And do the same on the other side. Very cool. That's what it looks like inside. You can also cut the corners you just made. Now it's really ready. And the bottom is nice. Now one more version. It's also very easy. I glue the cloth to the zipper the same way as before. And the further process is pretty much the same. I fixed the zipper with some tape. Turn the piece inside out and cut off the unwanted part of the zipper. Glue the side in this position when the zipper is not on top but in the middle. Wait for it to dry and turn it outside out. This one also comes out really cute. You can just grab and use it. Same as in the previous case, you can make it 3D if you wanna. Open the corners, tuck them in and glue the seam. Unlike in the first version, here you will have four corners instead of two. That's how quick and cool it can be. If this video was useful for you, don't hesitate to hit like and let me know in the comments which version you like the most. And see you in my other videos.